The further reference electrodes we have is the calomel electrode. Calomel electrode is a type of electrode which is secondary reference electrode. It is said as secondary reference electrode as it is uh, its E cell or its electrode potential is not zero but rather it is uh, it depends on the KCL solution normality. Okay, let's see the construction of this calmer electrode then we will apply the Nernest equation to the same and as well as we will see the reactions involved in this calmer electrode. Okay, so this is the calmer electrode. See, the calmer electrode the construction is as follows. See, the calomel means the mercurous chloride is called as Hg2Cl2 is itself is called as the calomel. So, that is the reason it is said as the calomel electrode. Okay, so a platinum rod is there. Okay, and to that rod at the end the mercury is attached and just above the mercury the mercurous chloride plus KCL solution will be there as a paste. Okay, and it is uh, covered with a glass thin film and then uh, the whole setup is inserted into the KCL solution. Okay, so this the yellow color part is the KCL solution, purely KCL solution and this uh, a silver color part is a mercury and just above that mercurous chloride plus KCL solution which is black in color and then this opening is used to attach this electrode to the salt bridge. Okay, so a platinum rod and a, a mercury mercurous chloride layers will be there and then the whole setup is fixed into the KCL solution and it is, which is covered with the thin membrane. Okay, and uh, an opening will be left over at the top and uh, it is connected to the salt bridge. Okay, and this whole setup is called as the calomel electrode and then the calomel electrode, the electrode potential varies with the KCL solution. Okay, the KCL solution, if we take one normal KCL solution which is also called as Desi normal caramel electrode and it has 0 0.3335 volts okay and then a normal KCL solution or a normal caramel electrode one normal KCL solution is used and which will produce a 0 0.2810 volts okay and then saturated KCL solution which is called as a saturated calomel electrode which is called as saturated calomel electrode which is widely used as a reference electrode and uh, it has a uh, potential of 0.2422 volts okay uh, the first question why the calomel electrode is used instead of using the standard hydrogen electrode because standard hydrogen electrode has some demerits or a standard hydrogen electrode cannot be used each and every time because of its uh, setup. The hydrogen electrode, the setup is, it is not portable and it needs lot and lot of space and as well as the standard hydrogen electrode needs a specific monitor and a, a huge monitor should be needed and uh, uh, it is uh, costly to maintain also. So to overcome all these uh, things, uh, the calomel electrode is introduced. Uh, the reduction reaction involved in this calomel electrode is the mercurous chloride will take two electrons and it will give back the mercury, a liquid mercury metal plus chloride ions will be there. And these chloride ions are common with the mercurous chloride as well as the KCL solution present in it. Okay, and then if you try to write a cell notation of the calomel electrode when it is connected to the hydrogen electrode this calomel electrode will act as cathode and the hydrogen electrode whose concentration is to be known 
will act as anode and the cell representation will go like this platinum comma H2 hydrogen gas at one atmosphere and H plus ion whose concentration is to be known will be taken as anode and then the salt bridge and the KCL solution in this case we can take various these three different kinds of KCL solutions with the different concentrations and then comma it is mercurous chloride plus mercury okay fine so this is the construction and the working of calomel electron okay now the applying nernst equation to the calomel electrode we will get the formula like this the emf of the cell or e cell is equal to i mean when we apply the nernst equation when hydrogen electrode connected with the calomel electrode Okay, and in this hydrogen electrode, the H plus ion concentration is to be known. Okay, and the cell notation already said it is Pt platinum H2 at one atmosphere pressure and H plus ion whose concentration is to be known, uh, salt bridge, and then the mercurous chloride Hg2Cl2 solid, and then Hg plus. Okay, so for this electrochemical cell, the E cell will become the E cell is equal to E cathode minus E anode. Then this, uh, when we apply the non elastic equation here, it will be 0 0.2422 when we take a saturated calomel electrode plus 0 0.0. 5916 volts of pH or if we convert this whole thing into the pH will, will be E cell minus 0 0.2422 volts divided by 0 0.05916 in this way the pH of the unknown solution will be calculated by connecting caramel electrode to the hydrogen electrode where unknown solution is kept.